Hey guys, this is Joey. I am coming to you from Merida, Mexico, and it is the next installment of What's in My Bag. So I want to share with you my latest collection, or my latest addition to my collection. This is a messenger bag that I bought because I noticed that the people of Mexico, and, and by people I mean students, a lot of the guys and a lot of the men carry messenger bags, and I realized that I had gotten rid of all of my messenger bags because I was just done with it. I, I wasn't really into it anymore, but now I am. And I like this one. And I like it that it's white. It's, it gets dirty very easily, but it's very cute. And it goes very well with um, my outfits most of the time. I always have some sort of lotion or something in my bag just because it, I feel nasty without it. And, and I actually have two in this bag. I have first. I have just a regular old um, Bath and Body Works Fresh Market Apple Lotion that has handy back or, or antibacterial material in it so that you can clean your hands because I do touch a lot of things here in Mexico. I'm always on the bus. Always, always. And I also have this wonderful, wonderful lotion that I bought in a store called, it is called, um, Le Amadine or something, I don't know, it's in French, but it's in Spanish, and so it's an artisan chocolatier. And I bought it in this store, and it is a wonderful, wonderful body lotion and hand lotion, but it smells just like chocolate. And I love that, That's, that should be illegal, because I want to eat it, but I'm not going to. I bought this in California, and it is a bracelet that just says Namaste. And it means the God in me bows or recognizes or respects the God in you. And I just love this bracelet and it was in my bag. And so, yeah, that's the next thing. Let's see. What else do we have? Well, I have my big wallet that you've seen before, but that can get annoying. And so I wanted to buy a little one, one that I could just keep in my pocket. And so I have this one and it's adorable and it's cute. And I bought it as well as CNA. And inside of it, let's see, I have, I go to the a university called La Universidad Autonoma de Yucatan which means the Autonomous University of Yucatan. And this is my ID. Here, I'll show it to you. This is my ID. It's cute. And I've yet to ever use it, but I got it and I love it. And there I am and whatever. Okay, there's that. And then um, I use the buses a lot, as I've told you. So I always have to have this card to get a discount. Now, I say a discount, right? That's a terrible picture of me. You didn't see that. Um, I, I say discount. The bus costs six pesos. But that, in reality, with the 14, it's around 14 exchange rate at this moment, that is 40-some cents, I think. And this ticket, or this, this card, excuse me, gets me about, no, it gives me exactly half off. It gives me, I have to pay three pesos to get on, and that's like less than a quarter. So it's wonderful, and, and the bus transportation is awful here. But it works, and to get around the city, I can always use a bus. I can always count on finding one, even if I have to wait for four to pass by for one to stop for me. I don't know why, I don't know if I just look like a mean person that they don't want to stop for me, but whatever. So I'll just show you the money of Mexico. I look rich because I'm walking around with a 500 peso bill, right? This is worth about 40 bucks, it's not much. And then I have a 20 peso bill, and then I have some I have my cute little cell phone. Here, this is the one I bought from Mexico. It's a um, Telcel, which is the biggest company here in Mexico for cell phones. It's wonderful, and it it doesn't do much, but I have a keyboard, as they say in Spanish, a teclado, and it's perfect for me to be texting, and I do a lot of that. And it's interesting. Every night I get um, news, or this, they call it here noticias, from the government. So I'm I'm interested to always read what it says, and it's talking about the United States and football and and Brazil and China and whatever. It's very interesting. Um, I have my journal. This is what I write in to keep myself sane here. And it's quite fun. I have all sorts of things in there. I have, I glue stuff in there. And it's fun. I like this. This is my journal. I'm reading right now this book called La Casa de los Espíritus by Isabel Allende. It is a wonderful, wonderful read. It's called in English, The House of the Spirits. If you get a chance to see the movie and or read the book in English or Spanish, please do. Fabulous read. It talks a lot about the political change in Chile and and I've learned a lot about not only Chile and about about this book in terms of its plot but also about myself through reading it. I love it. The way that professors and students kind of communicate in terms of getting documents over getting PowerPoint presentations is through these little um what are they called? Zip drives, I think. 
And this one I use just to stick in my teacher's computer and get whatever I need to get off, get off of the computer and then I hit the road. And then finally, I have my glasses because my contacts have been giving me trouble lately. And I don't know, they're not the cutest things in the whole world, but they do the job. And that is what I have in my bag. Please comment, tell me what you have in your bags. And if you want to, make a video and leave it as a comment here on YouTube. Or go to my Facebook, facebook.com slash Joey Pearson Music. And post your videos and your comments there as, as, as it pertains to this video and my other ones. I love, love seeing your comments and your videos. And I thank you so much for your support. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.